Eins, zwei. Ja, gut afternoon. Um, I'm uh, very happy to heralding this talk, uh, but uh, this series of talks. Uh, the following three talks in this hall here are about GSM. GSM is the mobile phone system that we all using since probably 15 years now. And as it is with all technology, in the beginning it seems very complicated and very difficult to master. You don't get the hardware, you don't know the protocols, it's all complicated and difficult. And after a while, after putting energy to it and meeting the right people and reading and building stuff, it becomes manageable. So the series of free talks about GSM uh, serves one big purpose, which is to prepare you for the fact that GSM is broken in a way that it only uh, wireless LAN without anything is broken in terms of other technologies. So GSM will end up in the hands of kids with laptops sniffing down your block to everybody else's phone call. So the free talks are split in along a bit of a logic. So the first part is about OpenBSC, which is um, the software behind the network, the GSM network that is running here on the, uh, on the camp. Um, the second part is about uh, a piece of software that's called AirProbe, which is a GSM sniffer that works um, based on GNU radio components on the um, USRP, meaning that is software that you can decode the bits from the air. And the third talk is about how to decrypt the bits that you sniff this air probe from the air and break the little bit of encryption that is still there on, uh, on GSM. So the first two parts will be done by Harald. Oh, and uh, we will have an ha approximately half hour question and answers at the end of all talks, basically in two and a half hours. Um, there will be a long question and answer session uh, of all participants. Can somebody? Ah, now, okay. So, welcome everyone to the talk on OpenBSC and how to run your own GSM network. As most of you will have noticed by now, we are actually running our own GSM network at this very event. Um, this presentation is about. Uh, uh, the technology behind it, the software that we use, and the actual setup of the network here, and the kind of implications and, and the meaning uh, of uh, the, the it has for IT security, and particularly cell phone security, if people can now you know, run their own networks. So first of all, why would you want to run your own GSM network? Well, basically for the same reason that you run other networks. I think when I was probably 12 or something, I was uh, connecting two PCs over RG58 uh, Ethernet, and I set up my first computer network just because I wanted to play with uh, you know, network technologies and explore Ethernet and TCP IP and so on. And uh, there are other networks which are not based on Ethernet, um, which nonetheless have the same widespread global nature, um, uh, which is, for example, GSM with its uh, protocol stack. And uh, why should you be able to play with one network technology and, and learn about it, educate yourself about it? Um, uh